Well, as we first told you yesterday, your energy bills should go down this winter. National Grid made it official with an announcement this morning that included the good news that you'll save on more than just your heating costs. Jennifer Mullen is live in Brunswick now to let us know just how much you're likely to save. Jenny? That's right, Liz. Even though we're just getting started with fall, National Grid's already focused on winter, and they say your winter bills this year could look a lot better than they did last year. As for how much of a difference we're talking here, they say that natural gas customers could see up to a 10% bill decrease this winter. They also, for the first time ever, gave us a projection for electricity customers. That also brought in some good news. If you're an electricity customer, your bills this winter could be up to 9% lower than what they were last year. National Grid says that decreases in part assuming that we have a normal winter and they're also taking a more aggressive approach as a company. This year they plan on locking in 70 percent of their supply compared to about 50 percent last year. Now something else that was new and brought up in today's announcement is this new pilot program that they've been working on. Uh, they just released some of the findings and this house here right behind me owned by the McDonald's is part of that program and they're going to continue to be part of it until 2016 and each month they get an energy report that shows how much energy they use and how their usage compares to their neighbors. National Grid says the McDonald's are one of 50,000 participants and they're one of the most efficient customers. So what can we learn from them? I mean the small things are things like plugging up outlets. The little prongs that you put in for baby proofing work really well to keep the wind out if you have one that leaks. Um, caulking, stuffing draft. Uh, areas, those kinds of things. We've done some insulating where we can. We actually have a new furnace. We've been here 35 years, so the new furnace was necessity as well as energy efficiency, but it's great. The McDonald's tell me that they're also going to be uh, turning off their water heater when they're away for an extended period of time. So they're excited to see how much that saves them each month. As for some other good takeaways from today's uh, findings in this pilot program that the McDonald's have found successful, you can see they invested in solar panels up there. That's something that they recommend to people. They say power down as often as possible. And also just programming those thermostats in those apartments, businesses, homes will make a big difference. So again, even though we're just starting with fall, these are all great tips to keep in mind as winter will probably quickly approach us faster than we like. We're live in Brunswick. Jennifer Mullen, CBS 6 News.